Hello everyone and welcome back to the Pixelcast TNT channel. Uh, today we've got a special video. Um, so i just swap over to this camera because I've got three cameras on there, 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 and here. Hello. Anyway, okay so today I'm going to be showing you how you can get a PC VR headset for $15, right? So down here, I've got a Google Cardboard. It's not the official Google Cardboard, but it's basically the same thing. Works with Google Cardboard. Um, has the magnet, everything. Right, so I bought this for 15 bucks. It's not a Chinese river off, it was just someone that made something for me. Well, not for me, but I bought it because they made it. It was like a school fundraiser thing. Anyway, so um, this is it. You, you, it looks exactly like the Google Cardboard, except it's different in some ways. Um, it's got the lens and everything. Anyway, so what you do is use a, um, right, so the steps for this is you need the Google Cardboard, which is $15. That's the only thing you have to purchase, basically. Um, I'm assuming your phone will support VR for this. Uh, so basically what you do, phone in here, right, in there, uh, I'm going to start the screen recorder. Just give me a second. Right, so this is the app, uh, Trinius VR. Uh, we'll swap over to this phone screen. So um, what you do is you turn it on here, and it's ready. You can do this through Wi-Fi or USB. I've done it through a hotspot. Um, we've got it open on the computer, both free. Uh, it's, this app is for Android. I'm not sure about Apple. Might be, it might not be. You might have to check for yourself. It's called Trinius VR, if I haven't mentioned it already. Um, I've got the light version. Um, so what it does is it, um, it just makes a VR headset sort of thing for whatever window you've got open. So it'll make like a really bad one for this because it's not that great, um, this little window, but games it works really well. Um, so it's very customizable, uh, like especially in the adjust lens and HUD fixes and everything. Um, so I've got fake roll on, so when I do this, it like kind of fakes a roll. So I'll start it up. Okay, I think the phone detected it. Yeah, the phone. The phone's uh, doing the mouse because it's uh, set to mouse. So what we'll do first is we'll check out a game, Nautica. So why not? It won't launch in VR mode. Oh, so what it does is it basically simulates. I'll start a new game up. So we go. We go into creative, and I'll just put this on. Right, okay, we're in. Just as I finish setting it up as well. Hang on, I'm just gonna go back a little bit so I can turn around. Is it, is it good? Right, okay, it's fine. Oh yeah, I can't, I can't go forwards. Let's move the keyboard and stuff. Right, so I just calibrate it by just moving the mouse because the mouse still works. Right, so this is me looking forward, so I want to do like that. Okay, so there we go. Look at that. Um, it's a little off center. There we go, now I can see. I saw like a massive Samsung logo. Right, so that's the game. I'm moving the thing around a lot. I need to make up a system so it keeps. Uh, the censored. It doesn't really. And I moved that myself. Whoops. It's really hard to get used to this. Anyway, so <laughs> basically, you can just look wherever you want to go. It's really good. And the, the phone's sliding out. There we go. I, I'm probably just going to put tape here or something, something to block it. But anyway, so it's it's just 15 bucks, and it works really well. Like. I love it. And it's like, ah, probably like, look, pod. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> no, we can go down there. We can go through this, this little hole. Through there. I love it. It's like, I don't have to pay $900 for something. Just to experience this, it's, it's really nice. 
So yeah, um, another thing that Trinius does is that it has a lot of presets for um, different VR headsets that you can buy. Um, because this one's not official, I had to customly uh, configure it to something that I liked. So yeah, yeah, you can configure everything you want. So the screen's not that great looking up here on the phone, but to me it's like it's fitting very nicely on this. You know, I can see um, my HUD. So anyway. It it does work. Holy shit! <laughs> it does work really nicely. Oh fuck, that's too close for comfort. Right. So yeah, Subnautica works really well. I can look around. I can have a look at this. Hell, me. So yeah, this this basically does um, mouse simulation, and uh, it puts the screen on in VR for you. I'm looking for the mouse. Uh, I mean the keyboard. Okay, I can't move around. <laughs> Explode ship. Here we go. Oh, I love that sound. Oh my god, that's so cool. Oh, that's actually so cool in VR. Oh my god. You know what? Let's recreate the scene from Molly. It's fun. I'm going. Oh shit! No, no! Oh! Fuck! Oh god. Right, let's not go down there. Stop sliding away, phone. Oh, this is so much fun. Okay, we need to try a different game. No, we need to. Do, we need to show that all games work. Right, so we're here in GTA, playing as Trevor in first person. Look at that. Just it works. It's a whole look at those buildings. So cool. Hello. Hang on, wait up. Oh yeah, I could just use my head, can I? Fake roll's not helping at the moment. Okay, we got this. Well, not what I wanted, but okay. Yeah, this is... Okay. Yeah. Just use this to turn a little more. Oh god. Trying to aim with your VR. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> oh god, this is so weird. Hang on, go first person, go first person. Oh shit! <laughs> We're falling to our death. Oh shit, shit! No! <laughs> Bang! <laughs> oh, we did. This is cool. I love this. I love the VR. Games that probably doesn't work that well with those third person games though. So that's that's cool. Here they come. God. Imagine having to do this with your magnet. <laughs> Look at all these barrels, they're just everywhere. Okay. That's Crowbar Gravity Gun. This actually isn't that bad with my GUI problems. I, I can actually read what's going on. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my god. Yeah, that works pretty well. Hmm. Oh, look at all the debris like flying past. Oh. Well then. That's pretty cool. Right, anyway, so that was um that was how to get your own 
that's how to get your own $15 PC gaming headset. Like it works, it works really well. Okay, there we go. Anyway, that is how you get your own PC gaming headset. Fifteen dollars, literally, and your phone. Free app. No, no, nine hundred dollars for HTC Five. No, no. On that, amazing. Looks really well. I have fun with it. <laughs> and um, actually, for another thing that I might be making a series on. Where it turns on the camera and I can actually see in VR, but doing things is a lot harder in Figure 5. I might try that out, and it was it works natively with this, so it, it actually I can see what I'm doing. <laughs> Unlike on PC, PC it's a little harder because this is an official, so the lens are different, the setup's different. But, um, because when I ask for cardboard, it doesn't fit this. Anyway, so uh, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like if um, this is what you've been looking for. Cheap. VR alternative. Um, anyway, guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.